Pablo Gunner here for a nerdy fitness vlog. Everything's going fantastic because I actually did two workouts for once. So this is what happened. So last night I went to work and the wife had got me all kinds of bagels because I guess at the bagel shop they I, I get all meat, which is bacon, ham, and uh, sausage with egg and cheese. But they didn't make it right, so they kept on, I think they made like three, I think what they did is they made three different bagels each with each thing instead of all in one thing. So, and they were thin, it's like thin pieces of bacon, thin pieces, it's a thin piece of sausage and a thin piece of, of ham, the sliced ham, not like the big chunk of ham, which would be great. Then I would be fine with just ham, but anyways. So yeah, and then of course she got the actual one. So. Last night, I was like, yeah, you know what? She made me all kinds of burritos, sausage, egg, and cheese, burritos. And so that's what I had last night is I had a sausage, egg, and cheese burrito on the way to work. And, uh, you know, my commute's like hour 45 or so. So that's, that's what I did. And then I got to work and... Uh, I was running a little bit behind on my workout, but yeah, I was like, you know what? I still made sure I finished my workout all together, uh, no matter what. So I did legs. It was pretty intense. And so here's the thing. I made it a little bit harder on myself, even though it was just barely. And so what I did is for my calf raises is I had five pound weights when I did my calf raises. Yeah, I know. You can make fun of me and be like, oh yeah, that's like little that's a little baby weight you know and it's like yeah but you're still adding weight and you're still making it a little bit more difficult for yourself and everything like that so that's you know that's the point even if it's a little bit it's building blocks this is all building blocks you start small and you go big over time because next week it's gonna be like 10 and then 15 and then 20 I don't know when I'm gonna stop though we'll see when it what what feels comfortable and that's that's why I go hey if it's uncomfortable I'm not gonna be ridiculous and do too much weight so yeah I see no point to that anyways so yeah so that was fantastic and then on top of that then I that was uh, I was pretty hungry because of that I was it was a pretty intense workout so I had half of the sausage bacon ham egg cheese bagel I had half of that and I was good. I was good for a while and then I was like, oh, I gotta give this guy a break for a couple hours so I won't have access to a microwave. So I was like, eh, I guess I'll warm up this food. Uh, I guess I'll warm up this food so I can do that, you know, so I can, so I have food. So I waited half an hour or it was, it was a couple hours before I, you know, between eating. So, and I was, uh, when I, I was watching the Gamescom stuff, through IGN is what I was doing. I wanted to watch Defenders, but I was like, damn it, Gamescom is on. I need to be on the up and up for Gamescom so that uh, Tony B and I can cover it, hopefully, if he's available, if he's getting enough sleep, if his schedule is normalized somewhat, then hopefully we can get together and talk about the Gamescom, as well as just all kinds of video game stuff. You got the Sonic Collection. You know, I, I played the Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry, which was phenomenal, and it's a strong buy. That's why you should watch my video on it, about it, review of it. And uh, and did some, did some podcast stuff as well. And then I had a yogurt. I had the blueberry yogurt with the chocolate and peanut butter granola in there. And that's what I had a few hours later. And then I got off around 8, well, 8-ish, 8 8.30-ish. Yeah, like 8.30. And so, uh, like almost, uh, yeah, like a little, I think I got over like a little over an hour and a half. So, yeah, then I went to go work out and I did my abs workout, which is kind of like the relaxed abs workout. It's not like super intense and hardcore, which is perfect. It's, it's mostly like, I feel like it's mo it's mostly core and and uh, upper body ab work instead of leg, you know, like stuff that includes legs because you do not want that after legs, after a legs workout. It's too much, which it, the, the soreness has not hit me yet, which is great. 
I was freaking starving after I got off work though. Uh, so I was, I was feeling a little animal, which I think is like to feel animosity to, you know, I think that's, I think that's what that is. That's what my mom says. Like when, when, uh, when my dad or me gets like really hungry and you get pissed off, you know, it's cause you're so hungry. Anyways. So yeah, I had the naranjo. It was fantastic, delicious. Hit the spot, perfect. And I'll probably have a cheese stick later. And I'm gonna go get comics today because I haven't had the chance to get comics. I've been too busy. So I'm gonna go to Twin Sons and Age of Comics to get my comics. I rather I like to have them in physical form, you know, over digital. But if if I can do digital, I'll do digital, you know. So, but yeah, so it's it's been a great time. Uh, Game of Thrones has been freaking insanely intense and crazy. In fact, like the uh, penultimate episode to the season, which penultimate is like, you know, like the second to the last pretty much. Um, so what that means, it's not the ultimate, but it's this, you know, next one down. But so yeah, anyways, so yeah, that's, it's been super crazy. And it's just, the wife was like, that was the finale. And I was like, no, it's not. And uh, I was right, of course. And so, I'm not right all the time, but when it comes to nerdy stuff, I know my stuff. So, I knew there was at least one more episode. I can't, I can't even imagine what they're gonna do for the season finale because of like the, the, the episode before the season finale was so in insane. So yeah, it's, it's just absolutely superb. Rick and Morty is also really good. Uh, this episode I didn't really like as much. It was a Jerry episode, which was, it was still funny. It just wasn't as good, I felt like. I don't know. Sometimes I, I like it more when like the personal stuff is the backdrop and the crazy, just insane random crap is the main focus. Uh, like when he was Pickle Rick, that was freaking hilarious. So yeah, um, so yeah, you should check out both of those shows. I want to, of course, watch The Defenders, but I haven't had the chance yet. And priorities, I'm prioritizing. Let's let's say that. Instead of saying I don't have time, let's say I'm prioritizing these things above other things. That's what it really comes down to. So yeah, so it's uh, it's been a grand old time. Wonderful, fantastic, loving it. Hashtag love and life, whatever. I don't know those stupid fake hashtags. Um, but, uh, so yeah, so, um, keep it real, keep it healthy, keep it nerdy, and love and pace.